The world is at a crossroads. Climate and disaster risks are growing faster than our collective efforts to build resilience. As of 2022, the global average temperature compared to decades past has risen 1.1 degrees Celsius with an expected global warming of 1.5 degrees by the early 2030s. Rising temperatures increase climate-related disasters, which have almost doubled compared to the previous 20 years. Today, more than 3 billion people live in climate change hotspots. Climate change is the biggest economic, social, and environmental threat facing humanity. But it can be managed by applying risk-reducing actions that consider climate information. Comprehensive Disaster and Climate Risk Management, a UNDRR flagship initiative. Comprehensive Disaster and Climate Risk Management aims to reduce risks to human and ecological systems using joint analysis and integrated planning. The Framework for Resilient Development in the Pacific and its complementary Pacific Resilience Partnership is a global first. It recognizes the need for integrated and inclusive approaches to climate change and disasters in ways that contribute to sustainable development. It's very encouraging to see countries such as Tuvalu, Fiji and Kiribati taking the lead to mainstream climate change and disaster risk through legislation. UNDRR is working with partners to implement the CRM program in several countries. As you can see, these hazards are all directly linked to the weather and climate, and therefore we can no longer continue implementing disaster risk management, intervention, and climate change strategy independent. Lastly, as part of our coherence agenda, any new projects targeting disaster risk reduction must be reviewed against climate risk management indicators because by managing climate risks, we are automatically reducing disaster risk. Colombia has an entire institutional and regulatory platform for disaster risk management and climate change. In Colombia, this work is being done by the National Planning Department, the Ministry of Environment and the DRM National Agency. It constitutes uh, an additional institutional burden uh, with overlapping responsibilities. For this reason, uh, we find very useful to apply in Colombia the comprehensive risk assessment approach in order to stop working in silos and promote an interdisciplinary work approach. The CRM program catalyzes technical resources from its partners, while maximizing the exchange of expertise from those with climate change adaptation knowledge and those with disaster risk reduction knowledge. It offers full spectrum analysis of risks in a country based on existing policies, plans, and good practices. This flagship program benefits from several of UNDRR's existing programs and established relationships with partners, which will inform national and local implementation. This is the only way we can protect the planet and poverty and ensure that all people enjoy safety and prosperity. A climate-resilient future is possible if we take joint action now.